Hey, what's up guys? Mike Fix It back here again, bringing you another DIY project. Uh, this is another fitness related project, follow up to my uh, kettlebell. Uh, it's gonna be a pull up bar. So I'm actually gonna use two by sixes. Most of the projects that I've seen have uh, incorporated four by fours. Uh, shout out to my boy Danny Waite over at Operation Reboot Outdoors. Uh, he's a really good uh, organization that, that helps out veterans and, and uh, does some really good things with veterans. So check him out uh, on Facebook, Operation Reboot Outdoors. All right, guys, I got most of my lumber cut here, and now you can see uh, I'm starting to lay out the floor. Uh, once I get the frame built for the floor of my uh, uh, pull-up slash dip bars, then I will go ahead and um, move it out of the way and level out the ground. All right, guys, as you can see here, I got uh, my tentative layout. So now I'll just mark the edges around when I come back, uh, fill in the dirt, fill in the low spots, get it as level as I can, and then continue the build. All right, guys, your uprights will consist of three two by sixes sandwiched together. For the pull-up bar upright, it will be 203 inch uh, two by sixes on the outside with an eight foot two by six in the center. Uh, the first step of this is to temporarily attach a two by six perpendicular to one of your 103 inch ends. That way it'll serve as a template for where the uh, upright will sit on your uh, frame. Uh, the next thing you're going to do is secure one end of your um, angle brace, which are the two 40 inch pieces that have a 45 cut on each side, and then that will uh, form a 90 degree angle. After that, you will start the process uh, that you can see here of uh, cutting out a section or a pocket in the 2x8 so that the brace will sit um, nicely and secure your upright posts without uh, wobbling back and forth. <laughs> 